in this video I will uh, show you the difference uh, in stripe integration when you are doing it with the next.js API and when you are doing it with the Deno and Superbase so let's get started first of all I will explain how you can integrate the stripe using next.js API so basically in custom checkout what you have to do is that you have to get the client secret at the server side and this is how the code looks like on the right hand side you can see that this is the typical uh, API endpoint and what we are doing here is that we are creating this uh, stripe object and then using this uh, stripe API we are going to create the payment intent okay and to create the payment intent we need to pass how much amount customer wants to pay then the currency and then payment method types so after this uh, code gets executed we get the payment intent object and from that payment intent object we are sending the client secret to the browser over here that's it it is such a simple code to get the client secret out of the server side now let us see how to do this in deno and in superbase functions so over here on the left hand side you can see we are using this serve object from server.ts the next thing that we are doing is we are adding this course headers now this is headers are required because if you want to enable the cross origin request then this headers will be required otherwise you will get those cross origin errors in the browser next thing is that we are calling this serve function and or here if the request type is options we are sending this course headers this access control origin and access control headers next thing that we are doing is you can ignore this part because this is not relevant but if you want to uh, pass some JSON data this is how you can extract it on the server side in Deno then we are uh, fetching this uh, stripe secret key using this deno.erv.get syntax and then this is our stripe data uh, remember that similar data we had passed over here as well on the right hand side then next thing is we want to invoke that stripe api so with the uh, node.js we have this stripe li library so you can directly use stripe.paymentintent.create but in deno we don't have that kind of library as of now so you can directly access or uh, call this api api.stripe.com slash v1 slash payment indent and then you can notice we are using fetch method post headers and you can see that in the authorization we are passing that stripe key and then in the body we are passing this stripe data so it will give us the response then we are converting it to json and then finally we are sending that uh, entire payment in it object to the client or you can also send the client secret like over here we can uh, we have sent the client secret similarly you can send the client secret only but if you want to send the payment object that is also payment into the object that is also possible that's it so these are some major differences uh, in Deno and uh, Node.js in terms of how we can integrate the stripe thanks for watching